guys welcome back to the channel and this lab is little bit tricky so i try to make this lab as simple as possible so first of all just log into the credentials and once you're done with this click over here and then click on activate and continue now just wait and activate your cloud shell it will take a couple of seconds so just wait for that and click on continue now in description box i will share this github link so just open that link and then click on this copy option just wait and it's copy okay now just wait for a couple of seconds click on got it and paste the command over here and hit enter now just wait and click on authorize now just wait for this command get execute and once it's done you are done with the task number one and task number two so just wait a couple of seconds and as you can see all the command execute without any error so now just simply come back over here and click on the check my progress for task number one and just click over here you will get a score without any issue okay now for the task number three come back over here now what we have to do we have to just create one load balancer so just simply search for the load balancer and i will request you please pay the attention because this task is a little bit tricky now just simply click on this create load balancer and then choose the tcp load balancer like this now from here you have to just choose the only between my vms like this and then click on continue now just simply scroll down copy this name okay do not copy that full stop just copy the name paste over here like this now for the region you have to just choose a us central one from here click over here and then choose a your network called my internal app now just simply scroll down now we are going to configure a backend so just simply click over here and then choose the instance group like this okay and if you're not able to find the instance group refresh the page and again just paste all the values okay now just simply click on the done and again click on this add backend and this time we have to just choose the instance group 2 like this okay so we are done with this click on this done okay scroll down click on this health check and then click on create health check for the name just simply scroll down and here you can see from the point number six just copy this name paste over here like this no need to make any other changes just simply click on save and you are done with the backend configuration now click on the front end configuration scroll down a little bit and from the subnet you have to just choose the subnet b make sure that you have to choose the subnet b okay click over here and here you can see in ip just click over here and then click on this create ip address like this okay now for the name scroll down a little bit and from here you can see from the point number three just copy this name paste over here okay then copy this ip copy that and here you can see static ip address click over here and then click on let me choose and paste the ip over here like this click on this reverse it will take a couple of seconds so just wait for that and it's done now for the port number scroll down and here you can see just copy this port number and paste over here like this and make sure just click on this blank space and make sure that the port number must be 80 okay now just simply click on done and you are done with the front end and back end configuration just simply click on create and once it's done you are done with the task number three
and is done now if we just simply come over here and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue just wait and let's see sometimes it might take time but you will get a score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab i hope you guys like the way i solved this lab thanks for watching and have a good day guys